I'm leaving school. <laughs> um, I'm moving back home to finish out the semester there. And that's impacted my research project. I am returning the books I checked out from the library. I found digital copies of them. Um, just so I don't forget to bring them back or turn them back in. And they also have a deadline of when they need to be turned in. Hello, it's Jackie. I'm making my week nine reflection vlog. Um, so you can't really tell in this shot. Oh, insert footage. My room is, yeah, very, very empty. Um, my family goes in town for my sister to do a tour of Berkeley, and then they took all my stuff. It was planned, but they robbed me. <laughs> um, so literally everything but my bare essentials are gone. I have my shampoo, my clothes for tomorrow. And that's it. Um, it's really weird to be moving out. Um, you know, I think that none of us had any idea this was gonna happen, but it's still weird to get these like end of semester feelings of like leaving and not knowing when you're coming back or if you're gonna see your friends anytime soon. Um, it's really weird to get them like unprompted within a week. So it was a lot to deal with, but we made it through. Um, got 4.48 psychosis. I'm bad at numbers. Um, really set the mood for this week and it did not quit. Um, I like it. I love theater. I love plays. I've had my own plays produced, like, I'm a big theater nerd, and I really enjoyed reading it, and looking at the aspects and the literature part of it, and, like, thinking about how it would be staged, what the characters would be, and it's just very interesting and very cool. Those are two really vague words, but it was a fun thought experiment and process of review. <laughs> Aside from frantically packing for two days, my life has been abnormal. Um, I don't think anyone's life is normal right now, but I have like nothing left and so that's really making it feel weird. It's really, really weird to be in a space that, like, two days ago was super homey and cozy, and now it's very bare. It's super weird. It's strange. Like, one of my friends is driving me to my hometown because she's also going there to pick up her sister. Um, her name is Deirdre. She's great. But, like, I'm gonna come out to her car with, like, a duffel bag of, like, my shampoo. <laughs> my shampoo and some crystals. Like, it's such a weird weird week. It's so weird and messy. It's very messy. I'm keeping my cool about this pandemic. Um, I think that the last thing anyone should do is panic. It's terrifying, but at the same time, 
you know, the worst thing you could do would be to lose control of yourself. And I think that there's a responsibility that a lot of us who are healthy and not uh, immunocompromised have to make sure that we're doing what we can to protect the more vulnerable in our community. I'm oh, sorry this turned into a PSA, but my mom's a doctor <laughs> and I've been thinking about it a lot. It's really- I'm going back to how weird this feels. Uh, you know, all I have is my string lights and, like, my melatonin, my Prozac, that's it. A uh, duffel bag. It's so weird. It's so weird. Um, Normally I end these with a see you guys in class or something, but uh, I'm not, so uh, see you on the web. <laughs> God, that's so stupid.